go ahead and let's see if we can get you going there. Go ahead and turn your camera on, Kenneth. Kenneth is working on his audio there, so we'll see if you can get your camera on. Okay. Not really sure what's going on there, but Kenneth, you got it aimed at your ceiling or your iPad or something. If you're not going to get on camera, we got to remove you permanently. So let's get your life together. We're not here to play any games with you. So let me go ahead and get you ready to go ahead and remove you here. Kenneth, point your camera at yourself, dude. Let's not play around. Here I am, but okay. you're not on camera, so why should okay. I get on camera? That don't Be- make sense. Because, hey, because, Black, you called, you, so. because you called me, I did not call you. Okay, but you're spreading content to millions of Black Americans, but you don't show your face, but you want me to show mine. But I will go ahead and show mine. So, a few questions for you. Thinking about the legacy of ADOS in this country, what are we doing after okay. 500 years this is uh, not this is not really the program for that. Okay. That's, that's not, I don't really discuss that kind of thing here, but what is your question? So with us having 500 years as ADOS in this country, would you say it's been successful? Are we trying to continue that legacy? Like, what's the path forward? Okay, this guy speaks in partial sentences. Uh, what has been successful? So I'm asking you what has been successful during our time in this country, because I recall Austin Holloman has spoke with you about SYSBM and you had an issue with that. So I'm trying to figure out what are we doing here that's so important that we shouldn't leave. Okay, show me a place on this planet where black people have more wealth, more upward mobility and than we have here in the United States. Go. So as far as what we have here in the United States. Okay, I said name the place. No, 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 no explanations. Just name the the country or geographic location. Name the place. No explanations. Just name the place. So there's plenty of continents and countries in Africa. Okay, y'all, y'all notice I said name the place. And well, there's plenty of countries Mm -hmm. in Africa. Notice he's not naming the place yet. Okay. So when I'm not debunking, I'm not debunking his argument. He's mm -hmm. doing. So as far as the place where black people have a significant amount of wealth. No, 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 no. Better. They got better, more wealth, more control, more socioeconomic mobility than we got here. Where's what control do we have here? Let's start there. No, 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 no. I didn't say we had any. Now I'm saying I'm not I'm saying tell me the place this would they have more. So tell me the place where they have. Tell me the place where they have more than we do. Okay, but why do we? Okay, have now do you all know this? Here? He's not doing that. I'm not here to because, say. Well, I'm not here to say how they, much we do they, or don't they, have here. I'm saying, tell me the place where black folk are doing better than we've built here. Name it, Jason. We're doing well here as a result of global white supremacy. That's the reason why we're doing well. Here. Okay, I think you're, wait, well you that. said that we're doing well in America as a result. Of global yeah, and white I know supremacy. What you're gonna say we're foundational black Americans. No, no, country. you're saying but, you're not saying that we did it in spite of white supremacy. You're saying that we did it because of white supremacy. Now I'm a foundational black American, so I'm not gonna say that we did it because of white supremacy. But that's what you I'm just said. You literally just said wealth, we did it because of white wealth, supremacy. Now he wants to change it. Okay, position is better compared to other countries well of course of it's sh- of course it should be because we built the damn economy right so what i'm saying is we built the economy what did we get out of that why are we staying and here? that's, that's the, really the no we out. have we have not gotten our just reward no okay, we have so not received that here and wait or we why not leave and build a legacy somewhere Sir, else? Sir, okay, tell me where that is occurring outside of our efforts here in America. Go. Well, we have been invited to Ghana. Okay, I said, no, we have not been invited so anywhere. Really? Don't give me that damn right to abode garbage. Anybody with a Google, I just bunked that a decade ago. It has not changed. That right to abode garbage is a damn bait and switch. It doesn't mean anything. That's why you can't go. You have a million hoops turtles go through. You have to have a bunch of people over there vouch for you. You have to get have the Dude, government approve it, million, sir. We got a million hurdles. We got to jump. Sir, we, okay, okay. Why then why do? why would I go to a foreign place to jump through hurdles and get less? 
how do you define less? Okay, sir, show me. Okay, I asked you, ass, sir, you're just talking about go Ghana. Further over there, right? Tell, tell me what has been built by black Americans in Ghana. Go. Well, not much because we keep hanging on to America. Okay, but you can't Our show me, go sir, you cannot. There. If the Ghanaians haven't been able to do that, why in the world would we go over there? Why? The Ghanaians have been subjugated to the same colonization that we have. And yet so we and yet we got point. and yet we got first of all, they invited it, unlike us. Second of all, we did more and better over here than them. Why would I go to people who are subordinate to me? So you view the Ghanaians as subordinate. Why not try no, to sir. Them no, sir. I, no, sir. I no sir. I don't view the Ghanaian economy as sub- Sir, let be Sir, listen carefully. Stop talking. I am not saying that the Ghanaian economy is subservient. The international exchange rate says that the Ghanaian economy is subservient. To the American dollar, right? That's your reference point? That's the only one that matters, sir. So why not take our American dollars and go over there where it's going to go further so we can build more compared to what we're building here? Okay, Here's, here's here's what you need to do. When... An African country gives us the same thing that Israel gives Jewish people. That's the only sensible response. That's the only sensible arrangement. When they give us a right of return. And so bur- oh, no, 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 no. Uh-uh. When they give us a right of return and mm-hmm. birthright citizenship, then I will take them seriously. Because you know what? We fought to essentially give them that over here with the 14th and 15th Amendments. Now, they've got rights over here that they still bull jiving around telling us they can't give us over there. Uh, No, we're done handing out freebies to other people. If we could get that done in the power seat of white supremacy under the most brutal white supremacist regime ever, Bull Connor Lincoln Rockwell, we if we could do that here, then they can do it. If they're not doing it, I'm not going to sit up here and watch somebody who's failed try to tell me what I need to do. So I think you misunderstand what I'm saying, man. Okay. You, you, are we at your girlfriend's house? No, nah, it's my crib. She just came home. No, it's yeah, this, yeah. Okay. When the woman comes home and you got to leave, that sounds like it's her place. But go ahead. Nah, that's my place, bro. Don't, don't. Okay, guys, if, if it's me, yeah, I'll, I'll be I'm, telling her, hey, baby, you can come back in 20 minutes. We, we handling business up in here. Okay. Now he's now he's trying to do, we got the struggle for G going on, but go ahead, brother. I'm just telling you right now, if it's your if it's your <laughs> place, the female is supposed to leave. Let me get the light on for you, man. Let me get the light on for you, man. Yeah, it's, inside it's, the coop. It's his place, but when she walk in, he got to go out. So uh, something doesn't add up here. But all right, something ain't computing. But uh, Man, something ain't computing. I wish this light was on so I could show you my car right quick. Dude, anyway, do you, I'm, sir? Do you think your car impresses me? I'm not trying to stunt. I'm trying to talk to you about Adolf. Okay. Okay. Do you do you think your do you think that that old Lexus impresses me? Well, I had a newer one, but I got rid of it. Okay. You got rid of it for an old one. You got during. rid of your newer the Lexus for an old one. You got yeah, rid of your newer Lexus. Yeah, the first time that okay. depreciate, acid appreciated, I made a nice lick off of that. Unlike you, I'm not materialistic and worry about buying trinkets from white folks. I'm not materialistic races. either. I just like math. But what do okay. to add hominem discussions, man? My point is, why shame people for trying to leave and start a legacy somewhere else? If some of y'all want to stay, that's cool, but what's wrong with some okay, of us Okay, sir, leaving? here's the problem. You have been asked to give us a better alternative to go to, and you all never have that. You haven't had it in Dude, 50 years. A number, you don't a have number it. Of alternatives, no, sir, you cannot show us a better. Like, you cannot show us a better one. So... What have you shown? Okay, now th- take a look at what they're saying here, folks. Well, you see what it is. So, sir, if you can't name a better alternative, you have no point. Dude, any country we go to is going to be better than America because our money is going to stretch longer over there. How's your money going to stretch longer we, if we, it's not? We can build. We can income? build more properties. We can own more businesses and control more assets than we do here. Show me a show so me a foreign show me a foreign country show me an only African two, country only, where white folk don't run it. Okay, Zimbabwe. 
Okay, let's talk about Zimbabwe's currency. Let's talk about Zimbabwe's government. Let's talk about Zimbabwe's attitude toward black Americans. Considering you twice as old as me, I would love to be educated. Let's, dis- let's, let's discuss Zimbabwe's currency, the hyperinflation. While I do understand that some of that does have to do with the colonial powers, Zimbabwe is still trying to get its act together. Let's talk about Zimbabwe's cultural structure. They are still not on one page over there about what they should do, especially since Robert Mugabe. Let's talk about their attitude toward Black Americans. While they are not openly hostile to us, once again, no right to no right of return, no birthright citizenship. I cannot get jiggy with these. So you're saying that the solution is to stay here and keep begging these folks. That no, don't sir. Like I'm saying that we got together. To if we got together, Africans didn't have to come over here and pressure us to make the environment hospitable to them. I don't need to go over there and pressure them to make the environment hospitable to me. If they really were on that, they'd already be doing it. They're not doing it because they don't want to work together. You guys have this pipe dream that there's some pan-African coalition going on and there isn't one. I'm just not being a fool and sitting up here being delusional about it. You don't have a friend over there. So you got an ambition to have one. Premise preparations, right? That's what you rather do instead of just working with your fellow brother, regardless of what country they come from. They okay, they have they haven't demonstrated they right? have not demonstrated brotherhood. When you can get that white going, let me know. Either, but you keep begging them for reparations. I'm right? not I'm not practicing brotherhood with white supremacists. I'm practicing brotherhood with black Didn't people. You say you buy your guns from a dude that got a Confederate flag in his office. I bought one of them there, yes. I'm not oh, okay. practicing. I, I I'm not practicing plural. brother. Uh, sir, if you think that me doing that was assigned to him a brotherhood, you might want to ask him what he thought about that. You shook his hand. No, I don't shake hands with people I buy weapons from. No. Anyway, and, there, and there's, not, and there's no. The ad, well, first of all, know. first of all, I didn't have to actually shake hands with anybody. I just had to get the box from the FedEx driver. That's the first thing. But second of all, uh, no, sir, I'm not here to practice brotherhood with white supremacists. I'm here to practice brotherhood with black folk, and okay. I don't, and so, I don't so, have to leave where I am to do that. So, so, Jason, let's stop right there. If you're practicing brotherhood with black folks, then why not build with Africans and Caribbeans? who have a homeland, who have another country that we can once, get resources once from. Once again, you have not demonstrated that they are trying to do that. You're trying to impose it plenty, on them. I know plenty anecdotally that want to do There it, you go. Okay, well, let me, when you happen, get them as a group, it harder to do that. sir, it doesn't, we as a group are on the same page over here as a group. They're not on the it, same page oh, with oh, us oh. as a group. Okay, so we as a group of black Americans are on the same page, right? Then why don't we have strong black families? If we're really on the same page, we can't even get our family structure. Sir, I'm talking about, sir, I'm talking about recognizing that white supremacy is a problem. Okay, recognizing that's a problem. So what is your solution? Okay, stop. As a group over here, we recognize that white supremacy is a problem. Our voting patterns, our voting patterns and socioeconomic trends demonstrate that. These other folk have not shown that at all. They dance and scrape and bow and jump in the streets if the queen dies or if a white man shows up. We ain't like them. So if I'm not mistaken, Jamaica is actually in the process of suing in the, the process UK for reparations. Okay, who's lead? Just like we're who's in the process who's of lead did they okay? How right? does that help us? Okay, this is what I'm saying, Jason. Every other ethnic group, and I'm I'm talking to you as a brother, man. I've listened to you for quite a while. But there's just one thing that's always kind of made me want to reach out. And this is it. Other groups have their own homeland that they can do commerce with. But your rhetoric makes it where we're trapped in this American. Our home, sir, we have our homeland. Our homeland is right here. Bro, so you're saying that we're going to compete in a racist country. Sir, our homeland is is right here. Instead of bridging and building alliances globally. Okay, sir, that does not change the reality. Our homeland is right here. You're saying that we need to flee our homeland. Bruh. Yes. Fuck this place. I don't don't know why you want to hold on to this. Like, can you explain to me? Here's here's what I want you to here's what I want you to do to answer that question you just asked me. Well, why would you want to stay here? So you're you're, a okay, patriot. sir, That's sir, me, right? sir. No, what I'm saying is that I deal in concrete facts. So here's your proof. If you want to substantiate the statement you just made, why would you want to stay here? Yeah, I want to flee. 
go and build whatever this is that you're talking about. You can do somewhere else and then give us something to come to. Oh, absolutely. I've okay. Got, I'm getting my and, money here. And all I'm right. Leaving. I'm not going to stay here like y'all. When you have that, sir, when you stop talking about it and being about it, then we'll I listen. I already to am you. about it, sir. I don't know. So you, you got the job done? Years old. You got the job. No, 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 no. What you got here. done? What do you have done over there for us to leave here and go to? Well, I haven't done anything yet because I'm all 30. right I'm in, in that case then i'm in the process just then, like you're sir, in the process right then come it's back come back to us years. sir no, come back to us when you got something tangible to present well right I'll now you got you pipe you dreams really got reparations sir you got That's pipe you, you have pipe about. dreams sir you don't actually you have got something. pipe dreams too selling these dvds and shit but do we have reparations after all this time, no, we don't, sir. You so don't, sir. You, sir. You don't even have a roof over your head right now. No, I actually do. And sir, you're literally walking down the block because your woman just put you out, and you're trying to tell the rest Man, of us what out, to do. We didn't even talk. What kind okay. Of in is that? I'll go back right now because I think you want to see me in the light. No, so no, sir. There's, there's, there's sir. There's, there's, there's light. Home. If you keep walking, you're gonna be in Abilene, Texas. If you keep walking. Man, you know why all mad. it took was Man, a female to, a female showed up and he's literally sprinting down the street, but he's gonna Man, lead us. I'm gonna walk right back and show you how I handle mine. Okay, well, dude, you got a while to walk back there. Give us a give me a holler back when you actually get there, and maybe we'll see what we can do then. Let me put him back in the waiting room when he gets his act together here. In the meantime, let me see here. Yeah, y'all, he's He's building Wakanda. He's building Wakanda. He's he's building Wakanda. You talking about conquering Africa? You need to conquer your damn living room. A few moments later. Um. He's he's running around the whole damn neighborhood over here. I'm gonna get to uh my folks on the phone lines here in just a moment, but uh, let me get uh Mr. Struggle East here. He's doing laps around the block. Go ahead and turn your camera back on, sir. I'm going to give you five seconds here. Turn your camera back on. There. Um, I'm, okay. I'm back, my dude. She let you back in the house. All right, good. Or he, he's, off, in somebody's, this, this, he's in somebody's house. I don't know where he's at. He's in somebody's this house. This is my spot, brother. Okay. This is my spot. My name on the lease. Unlike I still, I still hear crickets. A whole bunch of I dicks. still hear crickets. Yeah, okay, I'm there he goes. Side. He can't go in his own day. Quote his own right house. Here. Oh, right here. I don't see, I don't see her. She's chilling, man. Okay, I'm <laughs> uh, ma'am, ma'am, uh, uh, whose name is on the lease? My name on the lease. Oh, I, I asked, asked I asked her whose name is on the lease. I ain't no liar. His name is on the lease. He oh. pays all the bills. I'm, I don't, I'm, I don't. You don't you exactly. don't pay you don't pay any bills at all, ma'am. Bruh. She don't pay no bills. I'm so that, okay, I'm, okay. Like, well, no. I'm, I'm asking her. She don't pay, no, ma'am. You don't pay no bills, none, nothing at all. She's a stay. No. You're a stay at home woman. You want to pay some? We know you be tricking. Come on. He, he, she, she's a stay at home <laughs> woman. I don't know. Well, anyway, um, <laughs> the on, hair, <laughs> the hair coloring is on fleek, so we'll we'll leave it at that. Man, she just got off work, Jason. Too. But anyway, no hair let's coloring to do that. Okay, fine. All right. Let, let's get back to the discussion, my nigga. Because you ain't never showed your face in the ten year history you've been on this bitch. So let's keep it one thousand. Okay. Off, let's let's keep let's keep this real, my broke fifty cent looking friend. If I wanted your broad, I'd give her a better place to be, and she wouldn't be outside fighting crickets. That's for we damn certain. Doing some activities, man. Well, you and know what? If know I wanted, if trick, I wanted your chick, if I wanted your every chick, time, every I would show her know. what a new vehicle yeah, looks I'm like. Give her some money every time. No, right? sir, I wouldn't give her money. I'm I'd give her a real, I'd give her a real I'm man to be away. next to. I'd give her a, sir, I'd give her a real man to be next to. She would see what it's like to sit. She would see what it's. Your woman would see what it's like to sit in a new car, not some 2004 beat up auction Lexus. It's not 2004, it's a 2010. It's a uh, convertible coupe, and I own it. Yep. Cash, no debt. Y'all, like followers that pay enough. Y'all, he, like he is stunting that. I got no two. Debt. His Lexus no is, debt, his Lexus is like old enough to go to high shoe. school. His Lexus is old about, enough to go to high school. About the year, I'm worried about the tear. I'm trying to get up out of here. You understand me? 
while y'all up here in debt trying to stunt and act like y'all white, I'm trying to leave here and not be polite. So let's get that 100% straight, okay? So I'm not running around this bitch in debt over a shiny object. I could go get a new car right now. I don't care about that. I care about stacking up my paper, putting down 50% on the house I purchased so I'm not in debt, no mortgage. Whenever I reach a certain point of equity in my investment. We're so all impressed over we're here. At. We're all impressed I'm, I'm over really here. I'm really not trying to impress you because I have a plan which you have not mentioned. Your only plan is to beg for reparations. Okay. And then use these ad hominem attacks. To sir, here, and then y'all say sir, y'all built this country, right? sir here's my for. plan. Here's my Who's only plan. Here's my he only, no, sir, no, 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 here's no, 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 my no, no, no. only plan. Tell sir, tell, tell how, how, old is, how old is that young woman next to you? Well, she is 23 okay. and I'm 31. Mm-hmm. Now, I want you all to understand something. A big mistake that young women make is they get dreamers. They get fellows well, first who, off, I'm not a dreamer, okay, sir. sir. First of all, you're going to be quiet. What you have are individuals here who they get young, impressionable females who don't know any better, and they grab fellows who spend their lives pipe dreaming. Now, this is a young, old nigga who is very, very good for running his mouth and talking about a bunch of crap he cannot do. She's 23 years old, highly impressionable. I don't know if she has any kids. Don't know if she got any children. However, she's sitting next to him. He's spouting off a whole bunch of Wakanda babble about a bunch of mess that he cannot do and will never be able to do. And he's sitting next to her during her prime years. She's in the prime years of her life and she's sitting next to him and his struggle LX. She's sitting next to him. Sir, I'm in the top 2% of- Sir, you are in the top 2% of dreamers and nitwits. That is where you need to be. He is not going to be anywhere else. Calm yourself down, sir. He said, well, I want to speak. No, sir. He doesn't want his woman to hear this. But by the way, yeah, you find some young female who doesn't know any better. She doesn't know any better. And she's sitting next to him. 23 years old. Telling the rest, he thinks he's going to lead the rest of us at 30 years old. He's going to teach us what? What is he going to teach us at 30? By the way, he's still sitting over here in America. That's the part that makes you incredulous. He's sitting in America telling her that he's going to do all these big things. He's going to do all these big, wonderful, incredible things. 30 years old. He's going to make it pop off at 30. Now, he hasn't done any of it. Not a bit of it. He hasn't done a single bit of it. And he doesn't feel like he needs to. Hell, he's got his little struggle LX. He's good. He's not trying to build anything. He's not trying to do anything more except talk about, well, you know, the reason, baby, I couldn't get these other things done is because, you know, there's a whole bunch going on there right now. There's a whole bunch going on, you know, baby. I'm trying my best right here. I'm trying my best now. I'm I'm doing the best I can be. I'm trying to. And this is how young females end up getting themselves into trouble. So I just wanted you all to see what that was about there. I just wanted you all to see what that was about and what that was like. Because that's how a 23-year-old female ends up risking the rest of her life there. By the way, my uh, main moderator, Eve, she's drunk tonight. So 